Welcome friends to another video, welcome to another review, this time around, again, another fragrance from the House of Manchera, and this is Wild Fruits, a fragrance that was first released in 2011. The nose behind this one is yet again Pierre Montal. This is a uh, fragrance that's very interesting for me, it smells absolutely gorgeous, mainly because this is a uh, fruit salad combined with some uh, floral elements, and this is best suited for summer, summer days, hot summer days, but you can also wear this one at, uh, I don't know, the end of spring and the beginning of fall when temperatures are still high. This is a very, very versatile type of fragrance because you can wear this one dressed however you want to be dressed, casually, semi-formal, even formally, especially if you are attending events in, um, in the night, especially in the summertime. So it works absolutely flawlessly. It's a very clean, very luminous, very bright, very uplifting type of fragrance, but it also manages to be very elegant. This is a unisex fragrance, and to be honest with you, I see this one uh, being worn successfully both by men and women. It has some very interesting notes inside. Some of them lean to the feminine side, some of them come and counterbalance the feminine notes and manage to keep, uh, let's say, the composition uh, at a unisex level so males can wear it also. I've seen a lot of people also complaining about the performance of this fragrance. I'm not one of those people. I don't have any issues with this fragrance in terms of performance. And when I say performance, I mean longevity on the skin, projection and sillage. Longevity means from the first moment I apply it on my skin till the last moment that I can sniff this fragrance on my skin. So, let's talk about the composition really quick. We have in the top notes um, kumquat, citruses, lemon and grapefruit. In the heart we have blackcurrant. We also get peach, apple, violet and fruity notes. And in the base we have uh, white musk and cedar. So. How does it smell? Well, it smells exactly like it's called, like a uh, salad, if you want, of fresh fruits. You got a very beautiful zesty opening from the citruses. You got uh, kumquat, you also have grapefruit, you also have lemon and some other uh, citrus notes uh, that are undisclosed. But right afterwards comes the heart of the fragrance where um, you are taken over by the blackcurrant combined with peach, combined with apple. To my nose, it's green apple. And you also get some other undisclosed uh, fruity notes, but you also have a very beautiful violet note inside this one. Therefore, uh, in the opening and uh, for a good part, you get a um, zesty, citrusy, fruity type of scent. And afterwards, somewhere uh, in the middle of the heart of this fragrance, the violet comes on top of everything, but you can still feel the undertone provided by the fruity notes. Also, afterwards, the musk and the cedar intervenes in the composition, and that's when, uh, basically, this fragrance becomes a bit more on the manlier side, but not too much. I do believe that uh, Manchera managed to balance really, really great this fragrance. Um, I do believe their uh, idea was from the beginning to make it as unisex as possible. That's why, although you have peach in this fragrance, which is a very feminine note in fragrances, you also get that cedar in the base to counterbalance. You also get violet that counterbalance that, uh, that peach. And everything comes out really, really nice. It's very uplifting, it's very clean, it smells really great, it smells fruity, but not overly fruity, as it happens in a lot of other fragrances, and it manages to smell very elegant at the same time. Therefore, I see no problem in uh, men and uh, women wearing this fragrance together if you want. I don't know, you are a couple and uh, you can wear it at the same time, there is no issue. Uh, also, it's quite um, versatile, if you ask me, from a uh, group age stand, uh, standpoint, because this one 
it's very good for uh, teenagers, also for uh, younger consumers, but also for mature consumers. This is a uh, fragrance that uh, always reminds you of a holiday. It always uh, reminds you of the seaside. At least this is what happens to me every single time that I wear this fragrance. And uh, most of the time I'm wearing this fragrance in the evening, at night, before I go to bed. Because I like the feeling that it uh, manages to induce me. So uh, I feel really relaxed. I'm imagining uh, it's summertime, it's hot outside. I'm at the seaside, uh, I'm going for a swim, I'm on vacation with my family, with my friends. Um, I'm enjoying life. What can I say? This is what this fragrance manages to, um, I don't know, to induce me. Therefore, I like it. Therefore, I'm also very satisfied with the performance. I have no issues with longevity. It stays very, very well, especially considering that this is a... Uh, citrus fruity type of fragrance, uh, uh, citrus notes inside fragrances aren't the best for uh, longevity, for performance overall. Also projection wise I would say it's uh, generally moderate but for the first hour, first and a half hour it actually packs a punch and sillage though not very strong in intensity it does have good sillage for a long period of time. Therefore, I'm very satisfied with the performance of Manchera Wild Fruits. I highly encourage you to try this one out, especially if you love uh, summer scents, if you love uh, fresh, fruity, uh, clean scents, uh, because it um, really is a good fragrance, a good offering from the house of Manchera, compared, for example, with uh, the last one that I reviewed, which was uh, Manchera Oud Cafe, which in my honest opinion is not worth the money. But this one is actually worth the money. Therefore, as always, my friends, go ahead, purchase a sample or a uh, decant if you have the opportunity to test it out on your skin to see how it um, performs, how it smells on your skin. And only afterwards, go ahead and purchase a full bottle. From me, gets um, a full recommendation. I highly appreciate it this uh, fragrance and i highly recommend it thank you for watching as always my friends see you in the next one be safe be good peace